Okay, next question. 12 out of 20 students wore gloves to school today. What percent wore gloves? So let's write this down here. Part, whole, and percent. Which of these can I write down? Let's take the information in my problem. Okay, it's asking me what percent. So that means I do not know that part. That's what I want to find. Now I only see one number in here. But the other one is written as a word. This is your other number. It's written out with letters. It spells 12. So 12 out of 20. Now I see two numbers there, but I'm not sure how to tell which one is the part or the whole. Okay, the bigger one is not always the whole. But typically, if I see the word out of that phrase, it tells me whatever comes after that, that means there's a whole. 12 out of the whole 20 students. So the whole is 20 and the part is 12. So when I set up my percent proportion, that's pretty easy now. I have parts over a whole equals percent over 100. So 12 over 20 equals some number over 100. Okay, this is my part. This is the whole. This is my percent. All right. I can cross multiply and divide, or I can look at a scale factor. 20 goes into 100, so that one works nicely. 20 times 5 is 100, so 12 times 5 is 60. 60%. 60 now, and I would know that that should be about correct, or about the right answer, I can estimate. Because 10 out of 20 would be half, and that's 50%. So we're a little bit larger with 12 out of 20.